All right, I'll pack down. Let's get the Kung Fu Panda out of here. Oh yeah, back out in the woods. What's up everyone? Skinny G Panda here. Today is a little bit different. What we're basically doing is conditioning, like winter-wise, for one of our bigger backpacking trips. So tonight's only gonna be an overnighter. Uh, we are in New Jersey on a section of the Appalachian Trail, more in like the Dunfield Creek area and the Delaware Water Gap. Basically, what we're doing is we're gonna condition with our backpacks and we're gonna camp out for the night and then leave tomorrow. And the goal is to just get used to our backpacks, uh, start getting our legs used to the hiking, uh, because Thanksgiving weekend, we have an upcoming trip. So my backpack has 27 pounds worth of gear, shelter, food, water in it, some luxury items, you know, because that's how I do it. And yeah, we are going to start our hike with a pretty intense climb. Once we get to the top, we're gonna to be on a ridge line, which will be nice. We'll be able to set up camp before nightfall, maybe check out some other side trails, and then camp for the night. So I'll show you guys a little bit of the section. Hopefully get to show you my setup for tonight and what food I have, and go from there. All right, check back in with you. Sunfish Pond. It's cold. There's even ice right here. Good morning. It's cold. Really cold. I don't know how it happened, but I lost a glove. <laughs> leave it to me so it probably got down to the single digits or felt like the single digits last night it is definitely cold I slept in a tent my sleeping pad didn't hold up any air so my body is a little on the uh, rough side but the view is pretty incredible I'm gonna show you this look at what we get to wake up to Nice horizon. No sun yet. Here's where Smitty and Dragon slept. And this is the tent. This tent is the knockoff version, I want to say, of that duplex. So the tent, I guess the tent did really well, except for, for the coldness, and I didn't have it cinched down to the ground all the way up. So when the wind would blow, it would go under and through the tent and back down the other side. So I definitely felt every breeze that came through. Uh, but this is what I slept in for the night. As you can see, my sleeping pad right now has air in it because I just blown it up. I have my zero degree, uh, my zero degree top quilt with me. I did have to borrow a quilt. I tried down booties. Um, it took a while, definitely, to get warmed up. 
Underneath here I have an SOL just to help protect me from the ground cold. But uh but yeah. This is the setup. If you guys see my glove, that would be appreciative. I'm just kidding. I don't know where it went, but I gotta find it because this other hand's cold. But yeah, I'm gonna try to cook some breakfast. Oh yeah. I got it lit. Flames definitely down there. Wait for the water to boil. Got my bear canister. Breakfast. It's always the greatest meal. Don't mind my bagel. I but I uh, put peanut butter on it last night and then couldn't stomach it. So I kept it and it's like frozen solid right now. Yep, frozen solid bagel. But yeah, there we go. Dragon's all packed up. Smitty is getting there. He's a beginner, so we're just making him just rough it out and figure it out on his own. I'm doing pretty good. You are. And Kurt's down there. He's blending in for the hunting season. This one is for Krizikoni. Look at this majestic. Yeah. It's freshly new built. It's cold, so you can't really smell it. The only downfall to this one, Kriz, is that... There's really no space between the door and where you go potty at. So when you shut the door, I'll show you guys. When you shut it, you're right up close to the door. Yeah. It's pretty tight. So, if you're pretty tall in the front, it doesn't do a good job. Getting ready to finish out this hike. We are currently descending slowly. Uh, Dragon and I were talking and we came to the realization that after we complete this back out to the car, we have finished the Appalachian Trail section from Lehigh Valley, Pennsylvania to Jersey so like the northern part of the trail is done for us uh, this piece of the trail of, uh, I've already been on uh, if you want to see that video you can check out my Dunfield Creek trail video I'll link that down below but yeah all right we made it back to the car finished out a good probably 12 to 13 miles gonna get something to eat shower drink some water and just Enjoy the rest of the day. Hope you liked this video. If you did, hit the thumbs up. And as always, make sure to subscribe. Have a good one. Bye.